So uh, no one told me that they actually updated Modern Warfare for some reason. Like they actually added just two maps randomly. I mean, there's still content that hasn't been added to the game. There's like the CX-9 and then the, the Sick of Pistol, which still hasn't been added. They can manage to add two different maps to the game without really saying anything. We can get Kill House and of course we can get the Air Base map, which is really, really cool. But today... We are playing Modern Warfare, we're going to jump into Kill House very very soon here, but we are talking about one of my favourite class setups of all time. That is the 725 with the slug rounds and the sniper scope, man. This thing is such an absolute blast to play, so we're going to use in this class setup here today and on Kill House and have an excellent time here. Because we are doing a little bit of a throwback here, make sure you do hit that subscribe button with those notifications turned on. I massively appreciate it and it really does help me out, of course. We are looking for 5,000 subscribers very soon and 10,000 by the end of the year. So if you could help me achieve those goals, that would be absolutely fantastic. Of course, let's just jump straight into the class up, into the gameplay here, because there's some interesting things to talk about today. So as usual, the time stands for on the video's loading bar and of course in the description. So if you are looking for something specific like the class setup that we're going with today, or even the gameplay, if you want to skip to that, make sure you feel free. But we are doing something goofy here. We are including the riot shield in this bad boy for maximum toxicity. You just stand there, go like this, and no one can shoot you, which is very, very fun. To skip over that, we are taking a look at our secondary here, of course. We are including the lovely 725 with the slug rounds and, of course, the sniper scope. Those are two of the attachments, and you're going to have to wait a little bit for the rest of them. As for our perks here, we are looking for EOD, overkill, and amped. EOD for that explosive resistance, of course, is very, very important. Overkill so we can run the riot shield and the 725. And, of course, amp so we get that super fast weapon switch speed, which is very, very important for this class setup. If we want to play it right we got to have amp. In the lethal slot, we're going for thermite again for maximum toxicity. You can hide behind your right shield like this and then just go and you just donk people in the head. It's so fantastic. And the tactical choice is, of course, the stun grenade again for maximum toxicity. If we want to just mess around with someone, we can just chuck it at them. They'll be stuck. They won't be able to do anything. And then we can just donk them in the head with the 725. As for the rest of the attachments with the 725 here, of course, we're going to go over them here right now. We are not including a muzzle, no barrel, no laser. We're just taking the optic here in the Brownlee 32mm scope. This does make us very, very powerful at those medium distances with this. This is actual sniper. This is dumb. I love it so much. Then we include the Tempest Sports stock, of course, for that aim down sight speed. If you haven't played with this for a long time because you haven't played in Modern Warfare for a while, go test this out in Kill House. It's so goofy. It's so much fun. I just... I love this class setup. In the underbarrel slot, we are going for the Merc foregrip for that recoil control and aim down side speed, a fantastic option here as well. Then the slug rounds, you know we need that damage range with this thing being able to turn this into a sniper is ridiculous. It's so much fun. And then lastly, in the guard slot, we're going for that temper slim grip for that aim down side speed and sprint to fire speed again. Very much reminds me of the stibble grip tape. So as usual, we're just going to jump into the gameplay here. We're going to jump into Kill House, which is very, very strange that they've added, like actually added two new maps to this game without actually saying anything. Very, very weird, and there's still two guns that they haven't added, so gameplay time here. Alrighty, so we do have a very, very interesting situation in Modern Warfare at the moment. I'm not sure why they're adding new maps to this game. Like, it's been a long time since they've added something, and then they go ahead and add two new maps for no reason. I mean, there's still actual content that they haven't added. Like, they haven't added, like... No. <laughs> there's still, like, an actual gun that they haven't added to this game. Like, there's two guns they haven't added, actually. Like, the Sick of Pistol and the CX-9 SMG is still just in the game files, and nothing's been said about them. Can I actually hit a shot here? I think I want to hit a shot. Like, is that an option? Like, is that okay? I'm just going to walk in here with our right shield raised, ready to scrap. Nah, look at this, man. We're we unkillable right now. I'm just going to go out here and have a look. A little, little peeky peek. Yeah, this is fine. This is fine. No. <laughs> what an idiot. Oh no. <laughs> this is not going to plan, but this is one of my favorite class setups from games previous. Like Modern Warfare just had so many different class options that you could go with and they made the game so much fun. Definitely a little bit different this year's Call of Duty with like not having just like ridiculous things like this. Like there's no fire shotguns yet. Yet. It could still very well be fire shotguns. We haven't seen the rest of the game yet. But I mean just having like slow shotgun options and just oh just brings back really good... Oh, nah, get out of here, dude. Just brings back really good memories, man. Re... Okay. Nah, this is fine. Check the stun there. Hello. <laughs> you just running. <laughs> oh, this game's just fun. Can I hit... Can I hit the shot here? I actually don't... 
think I can. Oh, no, we're gonna... No, we're good, we're good. Oh, I forgot about fire shotguns, man. <laughs> You're playing Cold War for that long and you're just like, no, oh, this game's pretty normal. And then you jump into Modern Warfare and there's like fire shotguns everywhere. There's a lot going on, especially on this very close quarters map. There's like a lot to worry about. No. <laughs> I actually used to be pretty good with this thing, I'll say it myself. I used to be pretty good with this. There was a gameplay going around of me absolutely dominating on Rust, I think it was. N now I can't hit a shot. Oh my god, I'm insane at this game. <laughs> I could forget a double kill. <laughs> this game is good. This is a game. Alright, they're definitely going to come for us again. Look at that, man. Look at that. You didn't stand a chance. I forgot you could fire two shots with this in quick succession. And then we're just going to move up very, very slowly with our riot shield. This is good. It's gonna take some supreme. No. <laughs> oh, get me out of here. I just love how wild they went with a lot of the stuff in this game. Like, you just don't see it. No. <laughs> or actually, I think this is an Asian server? Southeast Asian server? Because the ping is. A little inconsistent, which is not ideal, but we're not here for serious gameplay, so. Nah, I'm unhappy with. Oh, no, he's dead. He's dead. This is fine. Just gonna. Ooh. No, we're good. Oh, no, I don't want this. This is trash. Give me this. This is what I'm after. I. I thought I killed that. I thought I was gonna definitely kill that man, but. Apparently, it was. Nah, we're good. This is fine. Hello. No, chill. Nerd. Take a stun. Is there a guy behind me now? No? Hang on a minute. <laughs> he just ran. It's like, nah, I'm not dealing with that. That guy's too close for me. Oh, man. I just love this. It's so much fun. Despite this actually being a mainline Call of Duty game, this reminds me very much of when I played that Roblox game mode that was just dumb. No! It just ain't happening for us today, and that's to be expected when- Ooh. Oh boy. <laughs> just killed myself. Alright, we're gonna take it serious. We're gonna be serious this time. Little unfortunate. Oh, oh, what? How is he still alive? There's a guy literally standing there. Let's have a little peek first. The little, little peeky peek. All right, we're good. Hello. What? Oh my god! He literally just teleported away from me. That was embarrassing. I, I love this thing, man. Why can't this be in, like, Cold War? I will admit, this game is a little, a little campy. On even a map that is just so close quarters, so far, oh, that's bad. Yeah, even a map that's just so, like, supposed to be... Oi. Supposed to be fast-paced. It's still... People waiting for other people to walk out into the open. Where is everybody? Oh, you're yeah, kidding. Nah, this is fine. We can make this work. Nah, we... There's a lot going on right now. We can't actually keep up with what's going on. Nah, we're good. We're good. Here he comes. Now nah, we got him. I want to cap the flag. Yeah, let's run. Oh, boy. Oh god. Help me. Help me. This is fine. I'm just gonna take some time. I'm just gonna get the munitions. Oh. No. Are you kidding? Oh, just give me a break. Jeez.
Yeah, I don't know what uh, what compelled them to add new stuff into this game, but I'm glad they did. This is a lot of fun, man. I'm I'm glad we got to check this out. I'm glad we got to just like jump in and have an actual good time in this game because it's a lot of fun, apparently. Like, I mean, I'm not doing very well. I'm 13 and probably five. No, way more than that. Like 13, 13. I'm even probably. And I'm just having a lot of fun, man. Check that over there. We're just gonna move up on this clowns. Block that. We run and we run and we run and this is good. Remember when the 725 was like literally the most broken gun in the game? Like it was just... Yeah, look at this. Look at this crowd control effort. Oh, they're gonna cap C on us. It is weird that people are still like playing slowly and camping on this map. We're just gonna... Ooh. <laughs> but there isn't really much to say. Like, this is cool. It's weird that they added new stuff, and I'm still not really 100% convinced as to why they did it, but it's cool that they did. It makes you remember that Modern Warfare was actually a very, very cool game. There was a lot of good things that I liked about Modern... Ooh. Okay, we're, uh, we're done, apparently. We won. We got the dub. I guess we had a fun time. We got 15 kills doing absolutely nothing. All right, we'll have our final thoughts on this in just a second, but it is very, very fun and very, very cool to be back in Modern Warfare again. It's been a little while, so it's always good to be back here. Man. <laughs> oh, Modern Warfare, Kill House, 725, just such a blast. Hopefully you did enjoy this one. This class setup is a lot of fun. You can still get away with sniping people in this game. If you haven't played Modern Warfare for a while because you've been playing Cold War, you've been playing Warzone, they did add two new maps into Modern Warfare, which is very, very exciting. If you do want to go check it out, make sure you do drop into it. This class setup still absolutely bangs. So if you haven't tried it for a while, make sure you jump in and check it out. Of course, thank you very much for watching this one. I do appreciate it. Of course, this little throwback was a little bit interesting. We're going to be back with the Cold War stuff very, very soon. Make sure you hit that subscribe button with those notifications turned on. I massively appreciate it. It really does help me out. We are looking for 5,000 subscribers very soon and 10,000 by the end of the year. So if you could help me out, that would be absolutely massive. And of course, I will see you in the next one. Bye.